Ruben, real excitement around the place. The Bulls coming to uh, Sandy Park this weekend. First ever South African team. You know them well, though. Yeah, no, it's going to be special. The Bulls are a uh, traditionally a very, very strong South African team. Won plenty of Curry Cups and arguably the most successful South African team in the last few years. I won back-to-back Curry Cups, also went to the URC final last season. So it's, it's going to be a big, big battle here at Sandy Park, I think. You had your first taste of European action last week. What did you make of it? It's a tough old game in France. Yeah, it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. I think the French bring a different kind of like vibe to the stadium. Um, yeah, really, really enjoyed it. Really tough. It's, it's good playing with French teams because they really bring a different kind of game. And you obviously uh, talked as a group beforehand about setting your European campaign off on a high and mm. five points over there was the perfect start. Yeah, we couldn't have asked for anything better. Uh, that's exactly what we wanted to do. And now, you know, it's, it's set us up nicely. So hopefully we can just do the same against the Bulls this weekend and uh, further as well. How much has Rob picked yours and the other Safa boys' brains about what to expect from the guys? Yeah, a little bit. Here and there in the, in, in the hallway and so on, he'll ask us a few questions, but... Not not much. I think, you know, the coaching team, they really do their, their homework quite well. So um, they know what to expect, I think, from the Bulls. Uh, they know it's going to be hard, physical. Got The Bulls have uh, really good backs as well, very quick and expected players. So it's going to be tough. You've been talking about how cold it is. How cold is it going to be for them? They're coming from 30 degrees. Yeah, 30, 30 degrees to, what is it, minus two, I think. No, it's it's going to be quite a shock to their system, system I think. So hopefully the weather definitely... Um, counts in our favour so I think yeah it's good Ruben we spoke in the past about how much you wanted to try different challenges and obviously the Premiership's mm. brought its own challenge but Europe is something else did you see a different kind of game last week? Yeah I did I did I, I saw how, how big the set piece was you know especially with the French teams they pride themselves on the set piece as well so scrums line outs malls was, was massive um, the French teams also very physical but at the same time you know like that they can just switch it on you know, and just throw all flows and throw the ball around. So you've got to be ready for anything, actually. So, you know, it's again, it's it's a different animal that you're facing every single week. So it's it's pretty exciting. And what have you uh, made of life now at Chiefs? You settled in and you seem to be really enjoying your you're scoring tries, top try scorer at the moment. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's a surprise. That's that's really a surprise. Um, I think all, most of those tries, except maybe one, was all set up by the teammates. I just kind of just finished it off, but. Yeah, you'll you'll take them anywhere they come. Um, yeah, but I feel like I'm starting to to find my feet at the Chiefs um, a little bit better and in Exeter as well. Um, so hopefully it just continues to to get better for me. Ten thousand more in at the weekend, so a big crowd yeah. coming in. Uh, what have you made of Sandy Park match days and that and the atmosphere? The atmosphere is amazing. I think um, you know the Chiefs really have passionate supporters, and you can see it's. I don't know. I didn't know it's going to be ten thousand, but that's that's amazing news. Um, and I think the, the supporters are also really keen, I think, on seeing new opposition. I think they're keen on seeing the Bulls play. It's going to be an historical day. First South African team to come play a Champions Cup match. So that's going to be great. Great stuff, mate.